hello shalom 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 hello hello mambo mambo uh salama um habari i am at milimani city mall in dar salaam tanzania as you can look behind me i am at the mall and whoo i want to do a quick live because i'm at the mall at uh, east africa dar salaam tanzania milimani city mall and i wanted to do a quick live video um i have 30 minutes and then i have a meeting so i wanted to do a video and chit chat with you while i'm at the mall sometimes when i do videos i'm always at home and i wanted to do it from a different view this time a different place so you can have a different view to see that i am actually on the continent of africa and i'm not just saying i'm on the continent of africa this is milimani city mall in dar es salaam tanzania so i'm just walking around doing a, a quick live with you it may be noisy hopefully you can hear me well because i don't have my earphones in and i'm just walking and talking with you and i just want to give you a different view of my current situation i am in east africa dar es salaam tanzania i am at milimani city uh, mall and it's one of the major malls here in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. So I want to do this quick live video um, and chit chat with you as I'm walking. I have about 30 minutes before a meeting that I have. So I wanted to do this quick live so you can see my view today and walk with me and talk with me um, at Milimani City Mall in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. And yeah, I'm just walking, y'all. I'm just walking and talking. I'm at the mall. And um, I just want to give you guys a different view today. And I am at the mall, so you can see around me, Milimani City. Yeah, Milimani City um, Mall in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. So yeah, I'm just doing this quick video because I just wanted to show you another view. Um, Hopefully it's not too much noise. It's, I'm not gonna go over there by the um, music because it's a bit loud. So much love and blessings to you too. <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania, um, Milimani City Mall. And I am just walking and talking. And I just I decided to do a quick live for you so you can see my view today. Uh, this evening, it's about to get dark. And so it's all, it's like 18, uh, so it's like six something, 6.30 right now. It's 6.30 and I'm at Milimani City Mall in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. I am in East Africa and I just wanted to show you the mall. We do have malls here on the continent. And uh, yeah, I'm at the mall today. And I just started to do a bit, quick video. Wanted to have you lay eyes on me and see that I'm at the mall today. And to, for you to see my view today. It is very beautiful and amazing. It's a gentle breeze out here, so it's not too hot right now. It was hot earlier, but it's a little cooler right now, so I'm at the mall. I have a meeting in a little while, and I want to just do a quick live. And I'm always in the same place when I do my lives at home, so I decided to do a live right here, right now, at Milimani City Mall, East Africa. We're in the East, uh, we're in the, uh, <laughs> we're in East Africa. Grace and peace, Reggie. I am at the mall. I'm in East Africa, Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. I am at Milimani City Mall in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. I'm on the east side of Africa, everybody. The east side of Africa. I'm on the continent of Africa and it's beautiful. It's about 6.30 p.m. and it's about to get dark. So just wanted to show my view here. I'm at Milimani City Mall, Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. And so just wanted to come and chit chat with you and give you a quick view of my surroundings. I have some people that asked me, well, I actually have one guy that said, lady, are you really in Africa? Lady, are you really on the continent of Africa? Okay, so I said I'm going to show more views because people are questioning me as if I'm not on the continent. But I am wanting you to see that I'm at Minamani City Mall. <laughs> I'm in East Africa, Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. I'm at the mall today. And it's about to get dark. But I wanted to do this quick video so you could see my current situation. And yeah, this is the mall, everyone. 
This is the mall. I'm at the mall today. And I have a meeting in a little while, so I decided to do a quick snippet of a video. I don't know. Yeah, was that the moon? Let me see. That is the moon. That is the moon shining above me. It's right there. Salama, Lizzie, Salama. <laughs> yeah, that is the moon behind me. Look up in the sky, y'all. Look, look, uh-oh. See that? That's the moon up there, y'all. See that? It's shining brightly, y'all. It's shining brightly. Anyway, I'm on the continent of Africa, y'all. It's beautiful here. I am in Africa. Africa is nothing like you think. You know, don't believe the hype. Don't believe the lies you've been told about the continent being scary. Uh, lions and tigers and bears, y'all. There are animals here, but not where we live, okay? If you want to see lions and tigers and bears, you can go out to the safaris and you can go out to the, out, out, out into these uh, woods and the, the uh, nature. But where we live, we have regular apartment buildings. We have the mall. Yep, that is the moon. It's right behind, it's, a, it's above the trees. That's the moon shining brightly. Anyway, we have malls and we have all that good stuff here on the continent. And I just want to come to you since I have a little bit of time. I have a meeting and I was getting sleepy. I'm at the mall. So I was trying to kill time. I decided to do a quick live. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Liz. Thank you to my faithful subscribers. Hello to my new subscribers and welcome to all my subscribers. Thank you for your viewership. Thumbs up, thumbs up. Everybody, thumbs up, thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up, y'all. Can you please like, share, share, and subscribe? If you know anyone that's interested in traveling or visiting the continent of Africa. Hello, Eve. If you know anyone that wants to visit and or repatriate to the continent, y'all, I've been here a year and six months. <clears throat> on the continent of Africa in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. I am here in the flesh because some people think that I'm not in the on the continent and I'm just speaking to you from America or from the West. I am on the continent, everybody. Zanzibar is nice. The only thing is um, with Zanzibar, I'm just saying, it's Mzungu land. So if you don't mind being around a lot of Mzungus, if you're leaving the West to get away from Mzungus, then you go to Zanzibar, then you're going to be surrounded by Mazungus. It's a lot there. Yes, you have the locals that live there, but the resorts and all that is owned by them, and they overrunning those. So when you go there, you're going to be surrounded by all these other nations. I'm not down with that, y'all. I want to see my own people. I want to be around my own people. So I'm in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania, okay? So they have beautiful beaches here, just like in Zanzibar, but Zanzibar is a lot. The beaches are like, like nicer and cleaner, I have to say. I know that's what I'm talking about. We we pass, we want to pass on the Mazungus. That's why I'm here. Um, we don't want to be overrun by them. That's why we left the West, okay? We came to the continent to be around Africans, okay? So yeah, that's the only thing about Zanzibar that I don't like. I have been there twice. I visited Zanzibar twice. And it is beautiful, but it was just too many Mazungus there for me, y'all. So I had to get I had to get to get and I had to come back to Chocolate City, okay? That's what I call Dar, Chocolate City. Yeah, you got Arabs and you got, you know, Indians and stuff like that. But, you know, it's, it's all good. You still got mostly our people. Yay. Welcome to, welcome. Come, come, come. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Yeah, y'all got to come back home. This is the continent. Y'all, this is what they've been trying to hide from us. This is what they've been trying to hide from us, y'all. Look, 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 look. Look, 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 look at the sky. Look at the sky. This is real. This is what they've been trying to hide from us. They've been hiding this from us. They've been telling us not to come back. They've been telling us that it's uncivilized. They've been telling us that it's not beautiful. They've been telling us that it's just uh, bug infested, you know, it has a lot of bugs here now. A lot of flies and mosquitoes. You got to have your mosquito cream. You got to have your mosquito cream. Dar is hot too. Dar is hot. But I like it hot. Because I'm from the West. I'm from originally from New Jersey. Lived in Colorado. And lived in Atlanta. 
And so Atlanta wasn't bad, but Colorado and New Jersey was very, very cold. It was icy and very cold. So this is nice for me. I love this weather and I could dress like wear dresses like this every day. And so and sandals and dress like I'm at the beach every day. And so it's just a beautiful place. It's a beautiful country as well as there are 54 countries on the continent of Africa. If Tanzania is not for you, you can always look at the other ones. Uh, but just come somewhere on the continent, get out the West. The West is going down, down, down. As the West falls, or the European nations fall, the African continent is rising. I don't care who gonna be the superpower, China, Russia, it don't matter to me. As long as y'all come back to the continent, that's all that matters. Let's, let's focus on Africa for change. Yes, they're trying to, yes, they are. Yes, they are trying to keep us from all the, the resources that are here. Everybody else is here though, y'all. Mazungus coming here, Chinamen, Arabs, Indians, all of them coming to try to take over because all the resources are here. Look at the moon above uh, that palm tree, y'all. That is the moon, y'all. That is the moon. That is the moon above that tree. It is bright. The sky, the sky is so clear here, y'all. Y'all can see everything in the sky. It's so beautiful. Yeah, but, um, yep, so, yep, they try to keep us from benefiting, y'all. They try to keep us from benefiting. They want to keep us from coming here. They want to keep us from eating fresh fruits and vegetables. They want to keep us from coming back home to where we were. Yes, it's always been about the continent. It's always been about Africa, Mama Africa, where it all began. So I'm a spokesperson. I'm pushing Africa, and I always have, and I always will. Well, I haven't always, but I woke up to the truth about me being African and who I am in 2017. That's when I started pushing the continent. That's when I started pushing Africa, even before I came here, you guys. So anyway i got a meeting i'm gonna get ready to go but i want to do this quick live for y'all let's see yeah so yeah that's the moon right there y'all that's the moon above that palm tree the moon is so clear here so yeah i have a meeting but i wanted to just do this quick uh walk through with you to show you the continent of africa um so I'm gonna walk back down here so you can see my different views. It's about to get dark and I wanted to just let you lay eyes on me. Oh, I got 11 people in the room. Shalom, everybody. Mambo, Habari. Hello, Salama, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Diaspora Connect. This is Wanda. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for your subscription. Thank you, thank you to all my faithful subscribers. Thank you to my new subscribers and welcome, welcome, welcome. CME, CME. <laughs> I love all these greetings from all these different countries and all these different languages. All praises to the uncreated creator, all praises to the most high Yah, Ahaya, who lives above the heavens. We give him glory and praise. And I just wanted to walk and chit chat with you and just show you my view. I am in East Africa. I am in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. And. Oh, Eve. <laughs> it's good. It's all good. Don't cry. Don't cry. Just be. I'm happy. I want everybody to be happy. And I want you to come back home to the continent of Africa where you originate. This is your home right here, y'all. Y'all, it's not uncivilized. Don't believe the hype. Don't believe the lies that your enemy have told you. Shalom, shalom, shalom. Shalom, 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 Michael. <laughs> Don't believe the hype. Don't believe the lies that your enemies have told you that Africa is not beautiful. That Africa is not rising. That Africa got it going on. This is Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. And y'all, y'all, Africa is rising. I don't care what nobody say. All these European countries, they fighting each other. Let them fight each other. Let them kill each other. Let y'all come back to the continent of Africa and let's just build it up. Okay? Let's build it up. Even if you don't want to come to Dar es Salaam, in Tanzania, you can go to any country. You can, there are 54 countries on the continent of Africa. Pick one. I'm, I mean, Zambia is a good one too, y'all. When I get to Zambia, I'll be going soon. I ain't gonna tell you when, but when I get to Zambia, I'm gonna take some videos too. So you're gonna see. The continent is amazing, y'all. It's beautiful. It's not like what we've been told. Yes, Africa is our motherland, y'all. It's our motherland. Look at this. Look at this sky, y'all. Look at this. Look at this. Look at the heavens. Look at the sky. 
and this is uh it's about to get dark it's about it's almost it's probably around seven o'clock now here in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania, 7 p.m. And so I'm at Milimani City Mall. Mall is the east, east, I'm in East Africa. I'm so happy, Julie Guy. I'm so happy on the continent. That's right. Yes, I'm so happy, y'all. If y'all come back, y'all be happy too. Y'all free. You ain't got no restrictions. You ain't got nobody forcing you to take no poison in your veins. Um, thank you, Ali. Thank you so much. Thank you, Mariko. <laughs> uh, so come on back. I, I had to show y'all this because I had one brother talking about, lady, are you really on the continent of Africa? I was like, wow. Yeah, that would be good. Document start. Your, everybody should do it. Whenever you come to the continent, hey, document your life. It could be like a diary for you. Start YouTube and start documenting your travels and documenting your journey. I'm doing that too. It just so happened I had started my YouTube channel when I went to Ghana in 2019, and then this is this uh, is like a continuation of that. And so, hey, I know that's the hard part, y'all. Is creating sources of income. You got to think of ways to be creative and how you, Mariko. Thank you, thank you, Mariko. You're welcome too. But um, think of ways how you can create income sources of income, streams of income. Oh, that's good. You got good money saved up, but just so, yeah, you'll be all right for a minute. You got to still think of streams of income. So think of like businesses you can do. Um, think of what you can do with your hands. If you can create something, if you can do hair, if you could do, um, create any kind of products, all the natural resources are here. So if you're good with your hands, if you're a good a writer, if you're a good singer, if you're a good, uh, whatever your skills are, you can make money doing it. But don't come here trying to find a job. You come here to create jobs. I got 13 people in the room. Hello and shalom, everybody. I'm at Milimani City Mall this, this evening. And as you can see, it's, seven. it's almost seven. It's probably seven now. I don't know, it's almost seven. But um, I'm at the mall. <laughs> I'm at uh, Milimani City Mall. I'm in East Africa. So this is what East Africa looks like, y'all. It ain't like no jungle, no animals everywhere. I've been here on the continent for one year and six months. I'm doing this video at the mall because I wanted to do a live in a different place besides at my house all the time. I'm usually at home doing lives, and sometimes I don't want people to think, oh, she's doing a live, and she in the West. She in America, and she pretending she on the continent. No, I'm in East Africa. I am at Milimani City Mall. Yes. What else? I want to spend my time building my. Yes, you don't want to work for other people. You want to create wealth for yourself, you and your family. So think of ideas that you can do for yourself, ways that you can generate income for yourself. You can do it, everybody. I didn't think I was. I didn't. I didn't even know that I had it in me to do it. But y'all, I'm learning to be a big true hustler, y'all. Not bad. Not not hustling bad, like. But I'm saying like working figuring out ways to make money um through my skills my abilities and my resources so that's kind of what i am doing um yeah so i created a business i, I registered the business i have two tanzanian partners and so i did create a business i'm doing a land and building project i'm working on that plus i'm pushing zambia's uh, there's a, a organization in zambia i gotta i gotta plug the organization because i'm promoting Gobedia, y'all, the gathering of the Bantu and diaspora Israelites in Africa. This is an organization that was created in Zambia to assist diaspora in the West to come back home to the continent because it's time. Your punishment is up. 400 years is up. You can come back home to the continent and you can find your piece of the pie. You can get your land. You can you can be free, y'all. You don't have to be in bondage and slavery to Mzungu no more. You don't have to work for them. You work for yourself. Create your own jobs. Create jobs for your brothers and sisters on the continent. You can just do whatever you was created to do. You There's no limit to what what you can do on the continent it's not easy but you gotta hustle and you gotta work but you could do it y'all you could do it yes think of streams of income you can have like whether you rent a place you have extra rooms you can rent that room out or if you know how to cook you can cook meals and, and serve plates um if you can whatever you can do you can make some money you can make some money y'all you can make some money so don't feel like you can't do it. Don't feel limited, especially now because we in a war right now, y'all. 
if y'all don't know war has been declared it's a war going on and you don't have nothing to do with that war you guys that's Mzungu them let them fight each other stay out of it Africans 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 stay out of the war when I say Africans I mean black people Hebrews Bantu Negro whatever you call yourself black melanated people stay out of that war that's mazungus them don't be praying for them don't be involved in that don't let nobody get you caught up in no kind of you, other wars that they got going on because it's prophesied that they would kill each other okay it's prophesied that they would turn on each other and they're turning on each other because they lay hands on us and they they, they enslaved the wrong people basically so now they're reaping what they have sown so Please, please, please don't get involved in any kind of wars with these Mzungus. Let them fight each other. Just come on out of there. Come back to the continent. Because when their uh, countries get all nuked up and blown up, then they coming back to Africa anyway. So you might as well already be here and get situated before they start trying to run here from their countries. Because it's all nuked up and burned up. All right? So I am going to end this live. I just wanted to do this so you can lay eyes on me so you can see I am in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. I am on the continent of Africa. I am at the mall, Mizumani City Mall, and I just want to do this video. I'm getting kind of low because I'm walking over here towards where I'm sitting. And so, yeah, I just wanted to have you lay eyes on me. I'm at the mall, y'all. And so, yeah, just chilling tonight and um, just wanted to say hey to you. Want to show you a different view to show you I am in East Africa. I am on the continent of Africa. I'm not in the West. And so I'm going to do another video in the next couple of days. Again, thank you to all of my faithful subscribers. Thank you to all my new subscribers. Thank you for your viewership. I do appreciate the time that you... <laughs> by Reggie that you have taken to view my video I'm trying to do be a little bit more creative and when I do videos and when I go places so it won't just be the same old same old standing around um, I actually got to walk let me walk back over here real quick I got to walk back over here so I, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna hang up yet I'm not gonna um, shut the video down yet because I got to go over here so, yeah, I just thought about something. I got to go somewhere over here. So I'll have you walk with me. I won't disconnect yet. I was telling everybody bye. But anyway, thank you all for all my faithful subscribers. Thank you to my new subscribers. Thank you for the time that you're taking to view my channel. Thank you for your viewership. Please like, share, and subscribe. Share my video with others if they're interested in traveling to the continent or Tanzania or Zambia. Let me know. I am um, um, representative. Um, I, I am sub. Um, sponsor not sponsor i am promoting gobedia the gathering of the bantu and diaspora israelites in africa i am promoting that organization and so it's in zambia so i just wanted to shout them out real quick and if you're interested email me at diaspora connect zero at gmail.com diaspora connect zero at gmail.com and then i can connect you with the zambian team so i will be ending this live now <laughs> And I will do another video in another couple of days. So I'm going to say right now, Salama. And I'm going to say peace, family. See you in the next video. Shalom.